I'm Ann McAvick at Live News Desk, keeping a close eye on the push for more voting laws on Capitol Hill. Taking a live look at Washington, D.C. right now, where the Senate is debating voting reform. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer calls it win, lose, or draw. He says the eyes of the nation will be watching when they take this vote. The legislation would establish national early voting and vote by mail standards, making Election Day a national holiday and require certain states to get clearance from the Justice Department before making changes to local election laws. And that comes as at least 19 mostly Republican-controlled states have passed restrictive voting laws in the past year. That's according to the progressive Brennan Center for Justice. And no GOP senator is expected to support the Democratic voting reform bill. Who are they trying to keep from voting? Black people, brown people, college students, uh, people who live on tribal reservations, trying to keep those folks from voting because they might vote Democratic. What they want to do is just basically have the federal government take over all elections in the United States. But Republicans aren't the only ones standing in the way here. While Democrats Kirsten Sinema and Joe Manchin support the legislation, they do not support scrapping a Senate rule, the filibuster, requiring at least 60 votes to end debate and hold a final vote on the bill. So at this point, no actual timeline for a vote. It could come tomorrow. It could come Thursday, but it could also be a very long week on Capitol Hill. We'll keep an eye on it. Back to you.